Hello, hello, hello. Today is day six of seven days of thankfulness. I, as I said um, on these last few periscopes that I've done, um, that I every day that I'm going to post or come on Periscope and share one thing that I'm thankful for. Um, as I said before, my birthday this year fell seven days before Thanksgiving, and so I want to do seven days of thankfulness. As I say every, on each Periscope, I'm thankful every day, not just this week, not just during Thanksgiving, because there's truly, absolutely something to be thankful for every single day. Absolutely, without a doubt. But this week, I wanted to share seven things I'm thankful for. And this week, uh, and today rather, I'm thankful that it, with all that that is going on and, and has gone on, I'm thankful that what I cho what I wanted, I guess I should say, or what could have been didn't happen. Let me let me let me repeat that since it didn't come out the right the first time. I'm thankful today on on the sixth day of thankfulness that I've I've, I've been doing. I'm thankful that what have, what could have been in my life didn't happen. That's what I was trying to get out. I'm thankful that what what circumstances or life threw at me in my lifetime that what could have been didn't happen. There were many times, and you probably in your lives have, have experienced things where you didn't see the good or the, the outcome becoming good, or maybe it was something that you thought that you wanted or needed or someone you thought you need, wanted or needed in your life or a job that you thought you wanted or needed, um, but you didn't get it or, or it didn't happen or, or didn't work out or you weren't able to go to this place, or you weren't, you just happened to not be at a particular place when something bad happened, or you happened to not get into a relationship that wasn't, that was toxic for you, or you got out of a situation or, or a relationship that was toxic for you. And I'm thankful that because of those situations, because I was able to not experience or not get what it was that I, I I could have that I'm a better person for it. There, if you've ever been on our website, on our Pain and Glory website, um, you've seen my my story. You know that uh, Pain and Glory was started because um, I myself am a domestic violence abuse survivor. Um, and so because of that, I started a nonprofit organization to give a voice to the voiceless, to give um, and, and not and domestic violence awareness is not the only. Um, initiative that that we that we cover but I started it because as I said I want to give a voice to the voiceless and 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 I'm thankful because had it not been for those situations that I experienced and came out of I would not have been able to share it and help other people and true enough at the time when I was with the person who was abusive that person I thought I wanted in my life and, and not even necessarily the person. I wanted to feel as though I, I mattered. Mm -hmm. And so because of that, I, I chose to be in a, in a relationship that was not in my best interest. But thankfully, thank God, I was able to get out of that, of that relationship and out of that situation. But what, are, what, are, what about the other things that a lot of times we experience that we know is the wrong direction to go in? And we try to force a round peg into a square hole. We try to force, you know, the situation. We try to force relationships. We try to stay on jobs and in careers with, that we know are going nowhere. We try to force friendships that we know are not enhancing. We try to force uh, financial decisions or, or that turn out to not necessarily be the best financial decisions for our families or for our lives or for our net financial freedoms. You know, there there's so many things that those, those woulda, those shoulda, woulda, couldas that we experience in life that, oh, my gosh, I'm so thankful that those shoulda, woulda, couldas didn't happen. So today, on this sixth day of thankfulness, I'm thankful that what could have been didn't happen. What should have been, by all accounts, didn't happen. But I'm walking into a destiny and a future and a, and a purpose and a promise that is much brighter, much better, much more fulfilling, and much more gratifying than what I could have ever chosen. 
when you when you depend on God to lead you and guide you and direct you and put you in a position for prosperity, not just and I'm not talking about financial, which is a was a which is a a, a byproduct of it. But what I'm talking about is that that peace that you get, that fulfillment that you get, that happiness that you get, that joy that you receive in in knowing that you're walking in your purpose and your destiny, I'm telling you, it is amazing. It is amazing. So listen, like I said, on this sixth day of my seven days of thankfulness, I'm thankful for that. So those of you who are, who are watching on Periscope or get the chance to watch the replay, I want to invite you to come and be a part of our 10-year anniversary. Pain and Glory turns 10 this year. Turn 10, actually. This is our 10th year of service, and we're so excited. We're super excited. And we're going to have a celebration, and it's going to be held on December the 5th. Um, you can log on to our website painandglory.com that's pain with a y p a y n e just like um, my name painandglory.com for information we are going to have the best time um they're having fun. Um, this time there won't be any speakers, anything like that. It's not going to be our typical Pain and Glory event. It's actually going to be, we're going to have comedian Craig Reed who's going to have us rolling, trust me, um, and a lot of other surprises that are going to take place. And we want to share it with all of our friends and supporters and family and those who were who are, have been along the journey at any point or just now finding out about us. Um, so we want to invite everyone to come out. Space is limited and there won't be any tickets sold on site, so you have to log on. So um, be sure to check us out. And uh, I am thankful for you just being with us. So see you on the next Periscope. Love you much. Love you, love you, love you. And we'll talk soon tomorrow on the seventh day of thankfulness.